Good morning, low bros. Alright, what are we playing? Super Ghouls and Ghosts. <laughs> Super Ghouls and Ghosts! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. It's a story about Arthur. In a land far, far away, <laughs> there lived a boy named Arthur. Man, boy, whatevs. A boy man. Little Miss Blue Hair Princess gets kidnapped by whatever is approaching the castle. Uh huh. Let's see. I'm definitely scared now. Crash! <gasps> Demon! It just looked like a chubby bat. <laughs> okay. Uh, we present to you the dungeon crawl. Sort of. I like this game a lot. Ready, go. Oh, you need your sword. <laughs> don't throw your sword away. I don't. Uh, this, not, this isn't a sword, this is a lance. It looks like a sword. It's a lance. Well, you're not supposed to throw lances either. No, there are many things that this guy isn't supposed to throw. Oh, he just keeps throwing them anyway. <laughs> you know, make it now. Yeah, one thing you need to know about the jumping in this game. You have the double jump, but uh, you need to com commit completely into the jump. In the sense that the game forces you to commit into the jump. See stuff like that? That can happen a lot. <sighs> Alrighty then. Watch how a master plays or something, I guess. There is another power up here. Oh, yeah. And, and how do you activate them? There are triggers. I don't exactly know how they work because I'm, I'm not a speed working kind of guy. Or speed running kind of guy, I should say. It's a bit unfair that the undead you can just walk past the blocks and you have to jump over them. Yeah, I know. Well, they're the undead. They're assholes. Well, still. There's the lines again. See, when you get the green armor, you get a, a better weapon. This is the yellow armor, and it gives you the Mega Man charge blast thing with the most annoying sound bit in the entire history of the world. It's the just listen to that. It sounds like someone is charging up a dildo. <laughs> Woo. Old games are weird. There are seven levels in this game. Okay, seven, right? I don't know. This first one isn't too bad, but uh, obviously, if you're not used to the controls, that's a whole other story. But uh, yeah, well, also, if you haven't seen a level before, I know that both Chris and I would would have wiped when that wave came. Oh, this is the boss. I would have wiped long before. Yeah, that. I mean, me too. Because this is... It looks pretty hardcore, actually. It's one of the more difficult games. But I enjoy it. It's fun. Coffee. 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 So these flying things are ghosts. Are they? But they are, they are not dangerous until oh. they do that swirly thing and they uh, become more corporeal. Whoa! Ah! See, that's a bad guy. Yeah, he, <laughs> look out for the sperm! <laughs> I'm actually doing pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop, stop. Uh, if you go back, you can jump one left, then right again. Off off the edge. Trust me. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't trust you. <laughs> it's just like a terrible trust exercise. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little golden boy! <laughs> I will name him Simon. <laughs> Simon the Golden Boy. Simon. Oh. Oh. No! Oh, risky, risky, but pro very professional. -like. <laughs> I mean, if, if you had been a speedrunner, very yeah. professional. Like. Ah. Oh. He's, fun. He's a fun guy. He can turn you into animals and shit. If he... A witch. Whee. Alright! The life of Pi! Sup's up, dude! No! <laughs> so this guy is almost as much of a warlock master of time and space as Rico Rodriguez! Is it Time Lord? No. Simon! What do you think? So far? What I do like about these old games is that they do challenge you. Uh, they don't sort of underestimate you at all. Yeah. The sound bites in this game, I just really, really enjoy it. It's very Capcom. <laughs> no shit. This game couldn't be any more Capcom. <laughs> <laughs> like, 
Arthur celebrates when he gets a new piece of armor, right when he's on a float in the middle of an ocean that goes insane. <laughs> I want you guys to explain to me what the boss of this level is. Because I seriously can't make out what he's supposed to be. It's, it's a waterfall! It's a waterfall! <laughs> no, <laughs> well, that's not the boss. I'm not thinking about the growth. That is a cat with a giant afro. Cat with a giant afro? Yeah. Because to me, he looks like a monster clam that's stuck in a tornado with coral on his face. And he shoots... <laughs> carrots! He shoots squid carrots at you. I seriously don't get this boss. And then, <laughs> some then he dies with an explosion. Well, of course. He's Capcom. <laughs> well, too. How else is he supposed to die? I mean... You can't just expend him to like keel over and tell my son I love him. Tell my clam His name <laughs> is Simon. <gasps> tell my clamshell wife. Plot twist. It all makes sense now. Shake that oh, out, baby. Simon, I'll save Simon. you from the flames. When I was a kid, this game, uh, this level used to give me nightmares. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not kidding. It's uh, Fonzie yeah. Fonz the Bear. It's uh, Harry Bowser. <laughs> Harry Bowser. Huzzah! <laughs> Prepare to see some flaming notch platforming. <laughs> okay. Or a singed asshole. Oh! <laughs> I'm the best. <laughs> Fuck! Not stupid. So are you. This shows it. <laughs> and then I'm gonna uh, hide. <laughs> <laughs> this jump animation is weird. <laughs> One of his arms is like it, it, what is it's like it's dislocating his shoulder to get his arm. Wait, yeah, that's, that's that's uh, one thing, but the other part is look at his legs. Yeah, I know. And I was thinking what I was thinking of maybe he maybe he kinda did this where he lifts his knee up, that's why his other leg is just like so far up. But that brings me to the idea that if one of his legs is here, how the fuck does he get his heel all the way back here? Yeah, and it looks like in in an armor. This way and that way. <laughs> it looks like a monster. Next level now? No. No. Uh, dead end? No. This is precision platforming oh time. Oh god. Never gonna be able to do this. Oh, and scrolling platforms. Nice. That, ble that are bleeding. I do like them apples. They're not apples, they're bleeding, scrolling platforms. Oh! Know your fruit! Oh, you're about to meet the most annoying uh, enemy ever conceived in a game ever. Spoiler alert? He has a name, I just don't remember what it was. This guy, Gandhi! Uh, monkey face! This guy is so iconic that he actually got his whole, whole entire own spin off. It's got four games in it called Demon's Crest or something. And his name is? Gargoyle? I don't know. He has a name I don't remember. Jim! Yes! Boom. The levels in this game, they're... I like this. This looks pretty cool. Uh, this is very, this is very mode 7 from this NES era. I I I want I want really really want to explain to you how mo what mode seven is, but I don't. I don't want what a ring ring wants. I don't I I don't possess the necessary descriptive powers. <laughs> Simon. Simon. Simon, must Simon Simon. What 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 is Simon's relationship to this character in this game? This this. I haven't figured it out yet. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. sure it will be revealed. Okay. Ewoks. Look like. She uh, they actually do look like Ewoks. I thought you looked like a lady with like pigtails. I don't know what kind of ladies you like to hang out with. <laughs> but... Ah shit! Oh, oh my god! Oh, ah! No, 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 no. <laughs> god damn it! Lady in the red dress. Uh. Uh. Speak of the shit. devil and you shall See, this is very, very bad because I. Simon. Simon. <laughs> Huzzah! I'm always afraid of punching myself. <laughs> yeah, please don't punch myself. <laughs> yes, stop punching yourself. <laughs> Super ghouls and ghosts, Super ghouls and ghosts. We're tiny Ewoks. <laughs> Is this humor not lowbrow enough for you? Oh, it's quite lowbrow. <laughs> <laughs> I love that you're saying it like that. 
It's quite no rough. Yeah, it's yes. rough. Rather. Rather. <laughs> Simon! Third Simon! Round. Come with me! We Simon. must get out of here! No! Oh, we're under attack from Ewoks! I don't know where they're coming from, they're pair from thin air! Simon, <laughs> follow me! Run away! Okay. You deserve an Oscar. <laughs> <laughs> Simon! You seem to be surrounded by a dragon anus. Oh. But it doesn't. Is it? What? What does it do? Fly around, and then it does this. <laughs> oh yeah! Alright. <laughs> it coughs up. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> you got my shield, that asshole! <laughs> okay. Uh. No, notice how this boss dies because I have a theory on this level and I have not read a. Let me guess, it explodes? No. He lost his head, right? And then look at the next level. This is because this is hilarious. This part here. Yes? Uh, apparently, this entire level is supposed to uh, take place inside the stomach of a ghoul. Okay. Or something. But since you blow up the head of that snake thingy. And proportions is not something the NES is, as the Super Nintendo is very often bothered with. I'm assuming you may be going inside the empty stump of the thing you, thing you just blew the head off. But his whole body exploded. I don't know. It's just a theory. This is the part where uh, where my nightmare started when I was a kid. This shit right here. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but... Uh, because it's so... Uh... Yeah, that, but if you look at the bottom of the screen, you see that, I don't know, guts kind of stuff thingy. Oh, shit. Guts kind of stuff thingy. Guts kind of stuff thingy. It looks like a bunch of anuses on top of each other, I guess. Look out for the blue brains. With spikes in them. Blowfish brains. Oh. Fuck off, dude. <clears throat> at this point, we're about halfway through the game. Ah! <laughs> Game over! <laughs> nice. Ah! Ah! Yeah! That was a. Tap, 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 tap. 